afternoon, I'm Sam Loveland. And I'm Richard Flores, and this is Wolfpack News for Tuesday, May 20th, 2014. The LRC will be closed during periods 4 through 7 for the remainder of the school year. All students should be in their guided study, freshman seminar, or ASP unless they have a pass to see a tutor, to be in the writing center, or to see a specific teacher. Clinics and auditions for students wishing to be members of the Color Guard will continue to take place on Wednesday and Friday from 6 to 8 p.m. All interested students should enter through door 3 and arrive to the band room by 6. Past experience is not necessary to be a member. Wear comfortable clothing, gym shoes, or dance shoes, but please, no jeans. See Ms. O'Neill in the band room B141 with questions. Want a snack during finals? Next Tuesday will be the last donut day of the year. Dick's Donuts will be here and will be $1 per bag. Sales will take place during the first half of passing periods and after school only. A portion of the proceeds will benefit the Oswego East Howell Fund. If you're taking AP US or AP com uh, Comparative Government next year, please uh, check Ms. Kyrus's website for updates throughout the summer. You can access the website by going to the OEHS website, clicking on Academics and Social Studies. Students enrolled in AP European History next year. You must pick up a green packet and return the last sheet with a signature by tomorrow to Mrs. Wren. And now it's time for sports. Here's Rachel. All boys interested in playing boys basketball this summer and next winter, there will be a brief meeting on Wednesday at 7 a.m. in the small gym. If you cannot attend, please see Coach Szymanski. The Oswego East rugby team is competing for the championship. The Chiefs include several local high schools, including OE. The Chiefs won the first round playoff ma match on May 14th and are now just two wins away from a state championship. They'll be competing in the semifinal playoffs against the Arlington Stallions this week. The game will be played at Crossroads Community Church at the, at the corner of Eola and Wolf's Crossing Thursday at 6 p.m. Come out to Crossroads Community Church and support the rugby team. Tonight, the girls' soccer team will play their first sectional game against Oswego High School at 7 p.m. Good luck, ladies. All wrestlers, there's a brief mandatory meeting after school today in the wrestling gym at 2.35. Please be there for important information. The varsity softball team is holding a fundraiser game today for Maddie Beatham, a fifth grade student in Yorkville who was diagnosed with lympho lymphoblastic lymphoma in February. Please come out and watch the team play Plainfield South, enjoy a cookout, and help out by making any no donations to the family. Any questions, please see Coach Nussel. Boys and girls interested in running cross country, there's a mandatory meeting regarding the summer running and fall season tomorrow at 7 a.m. in room B250. See Coach Cook or Coach Milner if you have any questions. That's the latest in sports. Now back to the Anchor Desk. That's today's edition of Wolfpack News. I'm Sam Loveland. And I'm Richard Flores. Join us again tomorrow on East TV Channel 16. Thanks for stopping by, Wolves, and have a great day.